my name is Jonathan Smart. I work for Innersone in Europe, the manufacturer of the Braden mannequin. I'm also a volunteer first responder with Southeast Coast Ambulance Service, and our group in Seven Oaks used the Braden mannequin to teach CPR in our local community. The Braden mannequin is obviously an adult mannequin. Um, we have recently um, introduced the junior conversion kit. This allows you to convert the adult mannequin into a paediatric mannequin representing a 10 to 12 year old boy. This means you don't have to bring two mannequins to your training uh, room. You only need to bring the Braden and the conversion kit. Okay, so obviously designed to be an adult Braden, but the conversion kit has a face skin, which represents a 10 to 12 year old boy, a torso uh, chest piece, which you can put, easily put onto the Braden, and a replacement spring, which is more representative of the compliance of a chest of a, of a 10 to 12 year old boy. So, first thing you would do is take the face skin off the mannequin, as you would in the normal way when you're cleaning the mannequin and then go into your kit and you'll see a replacement face skin which is representative of the 10 to 12 year old boy. Connect the o-ring connector as you would do normally with the adult so that it's in place and correctly located and then you apply the face skin same as with the adult it's exactly the same but this one now is representative of 12 year old boy. You then remove the adult chest skin, open the chest piece, internal chest piece to expose the spring, pull the adult spring out. This spring um, you have to apply 40 kilograms of elastic force to push the chest down five to six centimeters. Uh, studies, um, pub published studies, um, suggest that that is the correct force needed for the average adult person. Um, you will now need to replace that spring for one which is more representative of a child or a young boy of 10 to 12 years old. You'll notice in the pack that there's a, sp there's a spring and there are two plastic parts. The plastic part has a circular side and a side representing a cross. The side representing the cross fits into the bottom part of the mannequin, one, part, one of them does, so you put it in the, in the correct position and there is another plastic moulding on the upper part where the, where the um, rib, ribs are of the, of the mannequin and again the cross um, locates into part of the moulding. The spring then goes over the circular part on both sides and then you just shut the mannequin. It's important that these parts are in the correct slots on the base of the mannequin. Now you use the junior chest which looks is more representative of a boy and you replace that onto the mannequin. This is something that you might want to do whilst your students have gone off for a cup of tea, having a break from doing their adult BLS training, whilst you convert the mannequin into a junior mannequin. So you just locate the skin, and now you have a mannequin which looks like a 10 to 12 year old boy to be able to do your paediatric BLS session. The lights work in exactly the, way, the same way as the adult mannequin. Um, the force needed is roughly half the force that's needed for the adult mannequin. And you also can ventilate it in exactly the same way as the adult mannequin. You could use the adult mask if you wish, but if you want to be more realistic for ventilating a child, you can use bag valve mask, but using a junior mask. And the mannequin will work perfectly well with representative chest rise. Okay, so this is the Braden Junior Conversion Kit. It allows you to convert the adult Braden into a junior mannequin whilst your students are having a cup of tea or having a short break. Thank you very much.